88,000 candidates set for 2022 NAPTEB examination. The federal government of Nigeria has revealed that over 88,000 candidates sat for the ongoing 2022 National Business and Technical Examination Board NAPTEB certificate examination nationwide. This was made known as the Minister of Education, Adamu Adamu, who was represented by the Director of Human Resources in the ministry, David Gende, monitored the examination exercise across several schools in Abuja Municipal Area Council. Genda says that government will continue to promote technical and vocational education for Nigerians in the light of the nation's rapid development. It was a good exercise we witnessed. The students are all focused. Nobody came in with any, uh, what do you call it, uh, missile or anything. Uh -huh. Just like I addressed them, we are promoting the culture of excellence. Excellence doesn't mean you must be the best. Excellence simply means you can defend whatever you present anywhere. And that's what we want to see our students imbibe. Because the future is going to be tougher than what we are witnessing today. The stage is bigger. They are competing against others in other spheres of uh, the world. So they should be able to start preparing themselves from now. And preparing yourself simply means push yourself very hard so that you do your best. Whatever comes out, you should be able to defend it and present it for whatever, wherever it will carry you to. So we are impressed, we are, we are happy with what we saw. We have a, a significant increase in the enrollment and we have 87, more than almost 80, 88,000 candidates. In the past five years, it's been increased every year, uh, starting from... Uh, um, uh, if you check from 20, 2018, it was uh, about 55,000 candidates. But this year, you can see, last year was 83,000 uh, plus. So there has been a uh, steady increase in the enrollment. I think it is because of the realization that uh, Tibet is the way to go. Uh, because uh, in the world today, there is need for skills. There is need for... Uh, empowerment in skills, self-reliance, and uh, it's at the bottom of uh, uh, development. And that is why there's more realization that this is a very, very crucial aspect of education.